It's not a polar plunge, but Mickey Mackle is in high spirits, set to slide in to this frozen pond. This is like a pretty fun training for us to do. It's part of Ben Fire's ice rescue training, making sure firefighters are ready in the case of somebody, or oftentimes their pet, falling in. It's pretty frequent each year that we get a dog that goes in, a human goes in after them, they go in, and we are now trying to get them out of the water. In this scenario, another firefighter playing the victim emulates the real life situation. They'll approach that, uh, that victim in the water, they'll maintain communication with them, give them some instructions, they'll enter the water um, behind the victim. Once secured using the tether device, the team above ice gets to work. And then they'll assist the victim up and out of the, uh, the broken ice and uh, our shore base team at that time will slide them across the ice and onto the shore so we can start treating them medically. Oh! <laughs> it's how do we safely approach the incident to uh, stabilize it and affect the rescue, uh, putting us in the safest position possible to do that rescue as well as keeping the public safe. Ben Fire and Rescue have been forced to wait a bit this winter for the right conditions to train, but this recent storm cycle finally delivered. Usually it always ends up being weather just like this because of Murphy's Law, but uh, it's good for us to practice. We don't get to do this um, year round, so it's good to refresh our skills. Peyton Thomas, Central Oregon Daily News.